Burton-upon-Trent has long been famous around the world as Britain's brewing capital. Breweries may no longer be such powerhouses of the local economy, but they're still big business in Burton. Today, there was a royal seal of approval for the revamp of the town's National Brewery Centre. Joanne Rittle reports. The Princess Royal is not, by all accounts, a beer drinker, but she officially reopened the newly refurbished National Brewery Centre in Burton-upon-Trent. The gathered crowds, including dignitaries and schoolchildren, were out in force to help keep the town on the map as brewing capital of Britain. Despite the royal guest at this living museum, the brewing industry generally has been suffering. But Burton-upon-Trent, world-renowned for beer making because of the quality of the water, is still holding its own. The beer industry at the moment, overall it's declining, but here in Burton, where there's a real focus on real ale, uh, it's actually doing incredibly well. We've had a big resurgence in traditional craft beers like we make in Burton. Marston's is one such brewery that has seen a big increase in the popularity of cask ales. Over half what's made here is cask beer, which they claim is now being consumed by increasing numbers of people under the age of 35. Head brewer Emma Gilliland says the popularity is good news, but times are still tough. We've got the 20% VAT increase hitting next year, so that's obviously going to have an effect on you know, what people can go out and spend in the pubs. Um, beer duty has been increasing um, above the rate of inflation, so um, it, is, it is a very difficult time. Around 2,000 people work in brewing and associated industries here in Burton-upon-Trent. That's around 10% of the town's workforce. There are currently six breweries still operating here. That's a big drop from the 1920s when there were 33. The Chamber of Commerce is proud of the town's heritage. Like a lot of industries, you know, brewing is, is, has gone through a bad time during the economic recession. And especially pubs. Um, they've taken a downturn, but we're fortunate here in Burton we've got some of the biggest brewing companies in the world. Princess Anne was offered a beer away from the cameras. Sources say she didn't drink it, but she still raised the profile of this brewing town. Joanne Rittle, BBC Midlands Today, Burton-upon-Trent.